I've got a new 3D printer. This is my 3D printed radio controlled DO model printed on my TAS 6. The hardest part to print is the tyre, so I'm going to try and do that on the workhorse. Since making this tyre on the TAS 6, Polymaker have brought out a new version of their Polyflex material which apparently prints twice as fast. I've looked at the recommended print speed in the Polyflex manual. I've sliced up the part, two perimeters, hollow all the way down, two bottom layers and three top layers. There's the new tool head up here. It's got belt driven Z axis rather than the worm screw on the TAS 6 and it's got the modular bed system. So this is the PEI side. I'm going to flip it over to the glass side for printing TPU. I'll be amazed if this print profile works first time, but hey, it's worth a go. First layer is going down nicely. I'm about one hour into the print and it's going really well. You can see how soft these sides are, which is why it's a difficult print. The usual material prints at about 15 to 30 millimeters a second, whereas this new material is printing at about 40 to 60 millimeters a second on this stock 0.5 nozzle. It's finished and it's come out really nicely. This new Polyflex definitely prints faster and much easier than the previous version. Oh, that. It's a beaut. That is a success.